Hey guys, uh, let's learn today in PowerPoint how we can create a postcards in PowerPoint. Correct. So this is the just a random assets I would say which we are using in our upcoming postcard. So let me add a new slide in PowerPoint. If in case you are unsure how to open a PowerPoint. I'll quickly show you click on the start button and then click on this PowerPoint okay this is the software which we are currently working on so this is the slide this space is called slide I'll just clear this out selecting entire range and then delete it click on design section let's change the size which is 43 and then ensure fit okay so this would be your postcard size now this this particular size you can use in your meta okay you can upload it you can upload this on LinkedIn as well you can upload this on your Instagram as well cool so let me pull the assets over here so suppose I'm pulling out this image over here Ensure that you are giving some sort of space on the right hand side, left hand side, top and bottom as well. Okay. This will help us to arrange our context basis, the app which we are using to upload the postcard. Now this is the image. Now I want to add a some content over here, jazzy content I would say work and pursue in executive MBA okay in discover talent cool this is the context I have added so far now I want to add a duration so this is the duration I would say I just a duration 18 months program I'll just copy this again this is a part-time program or we will call it this as a hybrid okay whatever content you have I'm just taking this a random example let's arrange this later on first we'll add the content what type of content uh, do we really need it to add this I'll just copy this place control and just copy this total five modules I would say five modules are online and then remaining four would be in person so this is my institute which I am promoting so why we are creating this particular postcard okay whenever we are promoting our business on uh, specifically for digital marketing right when we are promoting our business we need to have to have a banner in place right basis banner we can you know expect more customer towards a business so this is the image or maybe brand ambassador for me I've just pulled this image picture format I'll change the color black and white and then uh, for this I'll play with the formatting which is font size right I'll just change with the font executive MBA and then this is the discover terrain. so now we need to when we are uh, you know creating any kind of a banner we need to ensure that we are focusing on our product instead of our branding okay so we are promoting or maybe create a this particular content in larger scale okay so basically I'm just creating increasing a size for the program so this is the size executive MBA and then I'll add some sort of color over here 
and then over here if you carefully observe just press this and then italic again this is the italic I'll do it and the color code again what I will do I'll keep it this bit lighter work and pursue in executive MBA so and so now what I want I want some logos okay so what I will do I'll just click on the icons okay my internet is down so I am unable to import a icons though but uh, what you can do over here is you can just go into the shape and then this is the shape duration or maybe if it's uh, duration I'll click on simply shapes and then this is the box okay so far we are uh, here okay I'll just press a right click format shape fill transparency would be less and the uh, outline if in case we are having we'll keep it as a no outline I'll just copy this again paste it over here okay if in case your content is too big ensure that your box is also enlarged basis the content correct so this is the thing and then We'll see overall duration so I what I will do I'll just do a bold underline and then I'll align this in a center formatting likewise program so for program I'll just zoom this okay so this is the program I'll just control X press enter and then delete key which will help me to adjust this text and then I'll just make sure that I'm sending this backside this particular box and then again this is the bold underline cool so this is the color change timeline right so we are just changing the color and then I'll just again make sure that this also we are sending it to back side okay so now again double click change the color this is the thing and then we are centrally aligning this particular thing cool so we did this thing now what we want we want a efficient formatting for this so what we will do I'll just do a insert a new box basically correct and then I'll add a so if you are seeing you know this particular box the content is a backside of the image or maybe shape how I know it okay so if you see this particular content part time right it's in black dark black when we are uh, seeing this four module in person it's in light black okay to pull that up again shape format bring forward now you're seeing this is in dark black likewise I think we need to do for this as well shape format bring forward so we are bringing this in forward great so now what we will do we'll just add this the background okay we'll send this to back so this will help us to work more efficiently with this like this I'll just arrange this 
and then this is, you can add the logos as well in dream okay uh, basis your uh, requirement my internet is not really working so that's the reason I'm unable to pull out the more and more images over here or maybe I would say logos rather and then I'll just insert a box over here okay so this is what we have created so far correct and if in case you have the company logos on your business you what you can do is just copy this paste it okay uh, control C and then control V uh, cool just zoom in you can take a zoom in or maybe what you can do just do a arrange your image basically right at the back side so I'm just arranging that okay and then I'll just cut this whatever section I would need it I just keep that only and then right click format picture 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 transparency ensure that keeping a light like this okay and then again if in case it's in light ensure that you're sending everything in back yeah so this is how we have created so far and then I'll change this uh, color because it's a too much eye catchy though so I'll just change this and then for this what I will do I'll just remove a outlines and I'll arrange this again like this I'll just change this color I'll keep it like this keep it in left side top and bit in right because we need to keep some sort of space in the left hand side bottom and top okay and then contact us okay so there are two things you can directly add a number over here or maybe when you are putting this particular banner on your you know website on meta advertisement LinkedIn advertisement or maybe Instagram advertisement right that time you can that time you can use this or otherwise this particular banner is good to go you can directly add contact us over here somewhere okay on the down you can add the numbers you can add the email id you can add your instagram logo your social media handles in the same banner and you can just post it okay basis your responses students will you know nominate their nomination if the right candidate are there and he want to pursue their executive MBA from so and so university right they can directly get in touch with you superb so this is how without paying any single penny right you can create your own banners postcards and creatives be your own hero be creative stay happy please subscribe my channel